What's up, everybody? This is Mommy Wata, and I'm back, you guys. I hope everyone is doing good at this time, and thank you so much for joining me over here on Mommy Wata Tarot. If you're new to this channel, please go ahead and hit that like button for me, subscribe to the channel, and make sure you tap that bell notification button so you will be alerted whenever I post, okay? I am picking up on some guinea pig energy, okay? I'm picking up on a number of females who did not realize that they were being used as guinea pigs for a masculine. Okay, I'm not sure what he was using them for, Holy Spirit. We need some clarity on that. But they're realizing that he was just experimenting with them. Okay, so Holy Spirit, what is the message that you have for us regarding this download that I received, Holy Spirit? What type of insight and guidance do you want us to have about this here? Okay, let's do a couple more shuffles and we're going to hop right into it, y'all. Messages, Holy Spirit, regarding this download I received. One more shuffle. Ooh, let's see. Let's go. Guinea pigs, Holy Spirit. What is the message regarding this download? Messages, Holy Spirit. We have the King of Pentacles. The King of Pentacles is the masculine in this situation, okay? This energy had a number of women that he had access to and that he engaged with. We have the Six of Cups. I feel like these were women that he kept in rotation here. What else, Holy Spirit? We have the Six of Swords. But this King of Pentacles is, is moving on away from this type of Knight of Swords energy, okay? Why, Holy Spirit? We have the Two of Pentacles. This masculine is trying to balance his life. I feel like he was experimenting and dealing with all of these various women because he was trying to figure out what he wanted and what he liked here i'm hearing who made him happy what what made him feel good we have a queen of cups this masculine i'm hearing y'all there's a queen of cups that he's been trying to find in other women Okay, he's been trying to balance his life with other energies because he trying to get the feeling that he felt when he was with this Queen of Cups. Clarify that, Holy Spirit. Now, I'm hearing that now, y'all. We have the sun. He trying to get back to that sun energy that he experiences or he experienced rather when he was with this Queen of Cups. She coming out here as the Queen of Cups and the sun. Y'all already know what time it is, okay? You already know what time it is. So this King of Pentacles has been repeatedly rotating and recycling energies, experimenting with various women to try to get that old feeling back that he had with this Queen of Cups. But that shit ain't working for him no more. He didn't gave that type of that type of behavior up. Because he's realized that there ain't, ain't never going to be, okay? Nobody, 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 nobody like you, okay? I can't say it right now, but that Kim song, that's what I just heard. He has realized it ain't never going to be no person that he can find to match this Queen of Cups sun energy, okay? All them other women, they were guinea pigs. They were experiments. They were people for him to figure out what he wanted to do with. And that's sad, but it's true. Okay? It's crazy, but it's true. These Queen of Wands energies, they were like guinea pigs for this man. He used these women to achieve an energy that he received when he was with this queen of cups what happened we have the nine of wands and he ain't been able to achieve that 
But these women are in the nine of wands now because this man has experimented with them and on them even, okay? I'm getting that this man has even tried different sexual things with these Queen of Wands energies in an attempt to get that essence back, that energy back that he felt when he was intimate with this Queen of Cups. And that shit just ain't working. So he's moved on. Left these women in the Nine of Wands because they realized that they were something that he was experimenting with. That he was serious about them. And that he's, he wants to have justice and a Ten of Pentacles with somebody else. Okay? This Queen of Cups energy. Can I get some energy on this Queen of Cups, Holy Spirit? Some insight about this. We have the Hierophant. I'm trying to tell you, this woman is exalted, hunty. Her energy cannot be matched. He has been collaborating with various people trying to get this Ace of Cups vibe. But he he faces his he faces blockages every time because this person is not you cannot duplicate, you cannot replicate, you cannot create this person. This Ace of Wands energy that this man experienced when he was with this woman it cannot be duplicated, replicated, imitated. Period, poo. <laughs> okay? Somebody need to hear that. We have the tower. And I feel like they did hear that. I feel like this King of Pentacles told these various Queen of Wands energies that he's no longer going to experiment with them in life. That whatever little shit they had going, that's over with. And it has caused a tower for these women. It's caused a tower for this King of Pentacles as well because the realization that he been busting them down, trying to get, get trying to, it's like crack, y'all. I don't know because I ain't never smoked crack, but I just have heard over the years, even when they used to have the, um, what that she used to call, be called, dare when they would come into school and talk to you about drugs and shit. They would say that crack, once when you hit crack for the first time, like that's the best feeling you'll ever experience in the world, okay? But this is why crackheads become crackheads because they're constantly trying to smoke crack to get back that first hit, that first feeling they felt when they hit that pipe. And this is what this damn, <laughs> wow, this analogy that I just got, this metaphor, whatever you want to call it. This King of Pentacles has been trying all these different kinds of crack, 808 on the phone, hoping that he can get back that feeling he felt when he smoked this particular crack, this Queen of Cups. This is not, I'm telling y'all, that's how I'm hearing it. Like this, this man cannot find this feeling anywhere else. And he been shopping around, okay? He been experimenting, child, with a number of different energies, a number of different products, and he cannot get back that initial original high that he felt with this Queen of Cups. We have the Four of Pentacles here. So he's withdrawn. He's withdrawn. He's going through a damn withdrawal. Okay? This shit didn't turn into a straight drug analogy because I'm telling y'all, this man has withdrawn from these energies. He no longer wants to take a hit off of nothing that they offering, period. These guinea pigs, he done experiment with these guinea pigs. I heard guinea pigs. Clarify that. We have the Queen of Swords. The reason why they're coming out as a queen of swords, y'all, is because once you di dissect a guinea pig, once you do whatever you got to do to that guinea pig, experiment on it, you throw it away. You discard it. And I feel like that's what this king of swords has done. And I mean, not in a nice way. 
These women are in the nine of wands in the tower behind how he's rejecting them now. You know, it's like he's going cold turkey on everybody that he used to keep in, ro in rotation. He's treating them like a queen of swords, like he don't care for them, like they're opposition for him somehow, okay? He's definitely withdrawn from these energies. What else, Holy Spirit? What's going to happen with this queen of cups? We have temperance. I was just about to ask, what's going to happen with this queen of cups and this king of pentacles? That situation is going to be balanced somehow. I feel like balance is being brought to this king of pentacles life right now because he's getting off these, these drugs he's been on. He's not experimenting with these guinea pigs anymore. And so he's starting to balance out himself and get to a place of peace and satisfaction about his life and who he is. And I feel like that's going to help him be able to have justice with this queen of cups. Okay. Being satisfied with himself. And not running to these random women to get his rocks off, to get a hit, okay? He got to be satisfied with himself. And I feel like that will bring in this Queen of Cups sun energy to his life. Clarify that, Holy Spirit. We have the Five of Cups. Then until he decides to take this action, no, he's going to be in regret. You know, he. I feel like he's realized that what he's been doing, okay? He's gotten truth and clarity about how he feels for this woman and that her energy cannot be duplicated, that she's one in a million for him. But he's got to heal from all of this experimental behavior, y'all. This man been out here doing a lot. Before this man can come and have a foundation with this Queen of Cups sun energy, okay, he's got to address his karmic ways. 1221 on the phone, he's got to be happy and satisfied with himself because he wouldn't have been out here experimenting with all these guinea pigs, with all these various women, if he was happy and satisfied with himself, okay? He gonna have to get in his Divine, divine energy, okay? This is what this is telling me with this hermit and this empress here. And then we got the seven of pentacles behind that. This man, in order, he look, and then we got the emperor, okay? In order for him to boss up, in order for him to be able to be with this divine feminine, he's going to have to do some shadow work and he's going to have to be careful about what he invests his time and energy in, into in the future. He's realizing this. He's got to come up out of this karmic behavior before he can connect with this woman. But the first step for this man was acknowledging the error in his ways, the reason why he was engaging with all these different random women. He was literally trying to recreate Find, duplicate, replicate, all of that shit. All the cates, okay? He was trying to do all of that with other women and it just wasn't working out. And he realized that, you know, he gonna have to go for the, the OG. He gonna have to, if that's what he want, he gonna have to go get her. Cause he gonna continue to be in the Three of Swords, operating the way he was operating with these other energies, these other women. Any final messages, Holy Spirit? Any final messages regarding this download? We have the Ten of Swords. Yo, this is his energy right now. I don't know if y'all saw how that fell on that Three of um, Swords like that, but this man, this is his energy and this is those Queen of Wands, Queen of Swords energy. He didn't cut some people off. He has ended all of this clandestine behavior why did I hear that word? That's what I, I have to look that shit up. I know what it means, 1444 on the phone, but I want to know if that's the right word in relation to what I'm hearing. Like, he was being very 
I don't know, y'all. We gonna I'm a we gonna look that word up. Look that word up too, y'all. But that's what I heard. So I don't know what this man was doing with these guinea pigs. Okay, because I'm picking up on some shit. But I'm a look, we got the seven of cups. I'm picking up on some shit now. He was really trying to figure out and twerk and tinker with these queen of wands, queen of swords, mind, body, soul, and spirit to get them to emulate. This queen of cups I'm hearing, really trying to build illusions within these women so that they would appear in her likeness. And that shit just ain't panning out no more, okay? Any final messages? And they heard about it. Because I feel like some of these women really did try to please this king of pentacles, emperor energy, only for him to eight of cups them. That's got to be a hurtful thing, Okay? But they didn't realize that they were they were up against crack, okay, when it comes to his habits and what he, the the energy he was looking for. Because she this Queen of Cups, we got the Ten of Cups. This is this is her energy. This is what this man been trying to get back to through these other women all this time, y'all. And I feel like this is what he's finally going to head towards now. Okay. I think I'm dropping the mic here. I hope this message helps you. I hope it provides you with the insight and guidance you may have been looking for. But always remember, if it doesn't apply, let it fly. Take only what resonates, leave the rest, and I'll be back soon with another one, y'all. Peace.